Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin because why not? And today I'm going to be doing a pink and yellow eyeshadow look. Please like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Thanks. Okay, so I pinned my hair back and I'm going to start by using the, May the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. It's clear and I'm going to be using it on my eyebrows. Now I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion on my eyelids. Okay, now I'm going to be doing my concealer. I like to do it before I do my actual eye look because if I do it after, it tends to smudge the eyeshadow, which isn't a good look. Then I just tap it in with my finger. Okay, I forgot to say this, but I use the NYX Cosmetics HD Studio Photogenic Concealer. The shade is CW2, the shade is CW00. Now I'm gonna be using the ColourPop Cosmetics Fade Into Hue Palette. I'm gonna start by using the shade Lovecraft. As you can see, I like to use my finger, but you can use a brush if you'd like to. Okay, now I'm going to put the shade Fantasyland over my eyelid. As you can see, the, the pink base still makes it look shiny and still look actually pink. Otherwise, without the pink base, it would just look like a bunch of glitter on your eyelid. Okay, so now that we've got the eyelid done, I'm going to be doing the under eye. So I'm going to be going in with the shade Bonus Points from the same Fade Into Hue palette from Color. I forgot to show you the brush I was using earlier, so I can show you now. So, this is from e.l.f. Cosmetics. It's called the Detail Crease. It's called the Detail Crease Brush. Uh, looks like this. And the brush I'll be using now is also from e.l.f. Cosmetics, and it is called the Eyebrow Duo Brush. Technically, yeah, it's for the eyebrows, but I like to use it for my under eye and the wing of my liner, and the wing of my eyeshadow. I'm going to be using the shade as a wing for my eyeliner. Now I'm going to be using the shade bonus points as the base of my liner.
Okay. Okay. So it's always kind of stressful to get your alliance to be similar, but I think I did it. Or I think I did it well enough. So I'm going to be... So I'm going to be going in with the shade Shine Bright from ColourPop Cosmetics. Right over the yellow that I just applied for the wing to make it look shinier. I'll do it right before the wing. On the under eye. And then I'll... Part of the under eye. And then I'll do it on the wing itself. Okay, now that we've got the yellow wing, I'm going to apply the shade Fantasyland that we used on top of the eyelid earlier and just apply it to my inner corners to give it a bright look. Okay, finally I'm going to be applying mascara. I'm going to be using the KVD Vegan Beauty Go Big or Go Home Volumizing Mascara. The shade is Trooper Black, and this is what it looks like. Sometimes when I apply mascara, I get it all over my eye. I feel like for beginners, it's gonna kind of be normal. So you just kind of, you just kind of gotta cover it up with some eyeshadow, and then it'll look all better. I do recommend that if you fix one side, you should you should add shadow to the other. That way they both look brighter because the one side you let sit for a while and the other side you let sit, but then you added color. So it'll look brighter because of the color. Okay, okay, this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I'll see you next week. All products will be linked down below. Thank you so much.